We've got a really short video today. It's gonna be very quick. I don't believe you. Uh, nothing too crazy, just little bits of me, how I stated in the last video, working on this cowl delete and making it look a lot fancier, a lot prettier inside. So when I go to do work on this car later in the future, a lot of this stuff is way easier. So of course, you know, you've got all this garbage in the way here. Trash, but I could tolerate it. That makes it really, really difficult to do. Uh, and then when you cut that giant cowl piece that covers up pretty much that entire back half of the bay, it makes life so much easier and it looks way better. Uh, and also the little paper thin filter that came on my car, I needed to get rid of that crap, it was garbage. But I'm gonna give you guys a really quick overview of it so you can see for yourself. So you guys probably can't see it on camera but we're going to be cutting from here, uh, alongside here and all the way through here and up to put the cowl portion up on the hood there. So let's get this bad boy going. We've got everything cut and I guess you could say polished and smoothed down, or not polished, but smooth. So now we just have to put the rubber gasket on and cut it to piece to fit on there. And then we've also got the nice cowl vented uh, uh, air filters sitting on the top here. I'm probably gonna get those swapped to either blue or red at some point, but whole motor's back together. We're ready to put the cowl piece on and this thing should be about wrapped up and we can move on to the next project. And we are on the last piece, guys, and uh, it's done after this. The, this cowl piece uh, is really nice. Uh, you can get them in whatever color you want. I mean, this seems pretty nice what it is for what it is right now. Nothing crazy. You just uh, get all this stuff popped up on there, get your pieces popped in, this clipped on, and we are good. And we are done. <laughs> Finally! I just need to get another piece to add to this so it's, you know, the nice little seals throughout the whole thing so it looks OEM and, but uh, everything is done. I appreciate you guys watching. Uh, this was a fun little project. We're gonna be getting all this nasty garbage fixed up here soon. The um, intake is obviously gonna be put on with a really nice one, a fancy one that doesn't say this ugly little BMW logo here that looks like poop. Once this is all done and finished up, we'll get more videos on the way. Thanks for taking the time, guys, to watch my videos, see all my shenanigans, and uh, me mess up everything I do. But again, an average Joe can do a lot of this stuff. You just gotta be patient, have fun while you're doing it. You're, also, you're obviously gonna be cursing a lot when you mess up on a little bit of things here and there, but it's worth it, it's part of the fun. And uh, thanks for watching, guys. Y'all have a good day, and uh, take care.